Who Comes with Cannons by Patricia Beatty. My name is Truth. I came to live in North Carolina with aunt and uncle in 1861. It was a hard time to be a Quaker in the United States. As Quakers, we do not believe in violence and were opposed to slavery. Aunt and uncle were even conductors on the Underground Railroad. They helped many slaves escape to freedom in the North. When the North and South entered a civil war, many Quaker men tried to flee to Canada so they wouldn't have to fight as soldiers. My cousins ran, but were captured by the Southerners and forced to join the Confederate Army. Even then, they refused to fight. The Confederates forced my cousins and other Quaker men to march in front of them into battle. They didn't even have guns to protect themselves. Cousin Todd was wounded and escaped back home. Cousin Robert wasn't so lucky. He was captured and placed in a Yankee prison. Read Who Comes with Cannons to find out how Frederick Douglass, Mary Lincoln, and President Lincoln himself help us try to rescue Robert and put an end to the horrors of slavery.